Hey mum. Me and Sparky, enjoyed that meatloaf and potatoes dinner you made tonight. What can I say? I think I make the best damn meatloaf in all of Shanks County. Don't you think? Yeah mum. I'm gonna have to learn the recipe so I can cook it myself. I'd be willing to pass it down to you. It's an old family recipe that's been passed down from generation to generation. And to think, your side of the family is in the same bloodline as Edward Longshanks, the Hammer of the Scots. Ha 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 ha. That too means that I'm a descendant of English royalty. Holy cow. Deke. Ha 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 ha. What a lovely evening, to go around and scare, a couple of poor souls, like you two. Please, Deke, not tonight. I am very tired, and I have to go to bed. I have a tough math test, I have to pass, at school tomorrow. Oh come on. Just let me play my creepy music for once, just to give you a good scare. Please. Hey Deke, you made it just in time. There is something new I've been trying out, and I want you to see it. Oh really? What is it? Ha uh oh. Sparky. Better get your earplugs. This is gonna sound like a wild pack of Canadian geese at the bread aisle at Walmart. <laughs> You really want to see? Okay, here it goes. I think I'm going to be sad. I think it's today. The man that's driving me mad is going away. He's got a ticket to ride. He's got a ticket to ride. He's got a ticket to ride, but he don't care. Holy screen gems. That was one of the worst things I have ever heard in my entire life. You ain't kidding, Deaky Boo. Did my mom really have to belt out that damn opera voice of hers? That almost made my ears bleed. Holy diabetes. I can tell you boys were entertained by that. Entertained? Fab chance. Now I'm gonna go to bed, wishing that I had never heard that. Agreed, Andrew. I think I will go home and rethink my life now. Holy heck, Rooney. Did he have to leave on such short notice? I was just about to do my cover of Sir Finbird. No 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 Thank God that's over. That was the worst opera voice I have ever heard in my entire life. And Andrew was right. It did sound like a flock of angry Canadian geese fighting over loaves of bread at Walmart. It's a miracle that Janet didn't shatter her glasses while doing that. 
I wouldn't want to hear her cover of Sir Finbird either. And yet, everyone knows that the bird is the word.